What's the story behind the helicopter? A green helicopter on there. And the guy that painted it, that Bubba is his name. Uh-huh. He paints, he said, there was a couple here one year. We was out here, this is our second time, maybe third time. But anyway, there was a couple here and he was uh, telling us about it. They come out, their son was killed. He was a pilot, helicopter uh -huh. pilot. And they had his ashes. And they asked, asked him if they could put the ashes around the rock at the base of it. He says, well, I'll tell you what. He says, the wind we get out here, it would blow them away. He says, now, I, I put a helicopter every time I repaint it. You give me the ashes, and I'll put it in the paint. Oh, so the then service member's paint, ashes are in the paint. Then when I paint that the helicopter on there, your son will always be there. Wow. He said, because that helicopter will always be there. He said, I definitely, it'll, there's always a helicopter on there. Sometimes there's more than one, but that one will be on there forever. Cool. That's pretty good. And he also, which the last time we was out, it's been several years ago now, but his, my wife went over to your shop and was talking to her, what his wife. He is going, he went around, to, I don't know if he's doing it, he was doing it to every county in the state of Iowa. All and 99. He, and he's painting. There's what it looked like one time I got, was here. Okay. That's cool. And he, uh, he his, his wife has a shop. A shop. In Green. Greenfield. In Greenfield. Okay. And that's where I got this. Okay. But uh, But I thought I'd show you that. He, uh, he, she said that he was painting a smaller version of this in every one in every county in the state of Iowa. Yeah, I know there's some uh, other places I go that are painted, yeah. but I don't know that it's the same as this no, one. No, it's, it's not as big as this one, yeah. one thing. He said, but there's going to be, there is a rock painted in every county in the state of Iowa. Now you two drove all the way from Ohio over here? Yeah. yeah. We, wow. We left, we left there yesterday about noon. And you come just here or you, other places? As it's all we come. This, this is the only, because I didn't, didn't, hadn't gotten to find out what's, what ones he's done yet in some of the other cities. Or, County. You know, counties. Counties, okay. But I don't. I don't know if they're going to be that as big as this one. No, it's not. It's not as big as this one. I, I've driven by here so many times on the interstate, and I decided finally to stop. Yeah. I always wanted to, and then I had a few people that, you know, said, "Hey, go ahead and stop." Well, her birthday's today. Uh, Happy birthday! What are you what? Fifty-five? Eighty-two. Eighty-two? Yeah. Oh, you don't look like a day over fifty-five. And I'm eighty-one, so I figured, well, well you married a younger woman then. We probably, no, she yeah, married. She's 55. She, no, no, she, yeah. that's what she said. <laughs> she's, been, she's been telling everybody all year now, she says, I'm 20, I'm 82. I said, you're not 82, not yet. Oh, you, you won't be So you married an older woman. Yep. Oh, she wanted to marry the young guys. She taught me everything. I <laughs> <laughs> well, used to have newspaper articles in there of things that they had written up about the artist and, and the rock. Oh, okay. And I guess he's running for, what was it? He's running for some government office now. Oh, okay. Bubba, the owner, I mean, the guy that painted it. His name's on there. Well, he doesn't actually own the rock. He just, no, somebody else owns it's it. On, his name is on there. Yeah. On the other side, down towards the bottom. It's got his name, Bubba. Oh, okay. Sor Sorensen, the second. Okay. That's his name, but uh, the one one guy we talked to, how I'm trying to find this place, with all the detour and construction and everything going on. Yeah. But uh, he said that uh, he's running for office now. Uh, Bubba, uh, is, is the guy that painted this. He'll move a rock in front of the White House lawn and paint it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, I do. I ought to do something, I'll tell you. <laughs> Well, anyway, it was nice talking to you. Nice meeting you. I'm Bill Trammell. 
Terry Huntsbury, Bill. Did you sign you, the book? No, I didn't sign the book. Oh, Is there one there? Yeah. There's oh, okay. And um, were you in the military at all? No. No? Uh, were you? No. No? No? Okay. She Sally. saw that she's this Sally. My name's Terry, first name. But she saw it on television years ago. And she said, The Rock. She said, They showed it. And she thought there was more than one. And when we saw that one, we, we looked all over for the rest of them. Oh, okay. And then when we went into the in the little town, town talk Greenfield, to talked to her as his wife. She said, no, that's the only rock. The big one, that's the only one. Oh, okay. But, so, we bought But the rock. last time, last year or the year before? Oh, it was longer than that, I know. It's been several years. Oh, no. Okay. Not since we found out that he was going to go to the different counties in Iowa. And he that. had 90, 99 of them today. He was... He had 99 of them in the county, in 99 counties, but he didn't have that many of them done. He no. had started them, he but he didn't have them done. Yeah, yeah. probably yeah. hard finding a big enough rock sometimes. Yeah. So anyway. Well, you guys have a great day. Uh, I, you know, it's special for me because I retired Navy. Yeah. Uh, spent 25 years in the service, so I, you know, well, her brother always appreciate in, this. He was in the Navy. He was in the Navy. He was, he was a cook. On an air, aircraft carrier. I was a military police investigator. You were? Yeah. So.